Our next input type is going to be um, through the telephone. Um, we've already filled out the form in a, a number of different ways, ranging from handwritten, machine print, um, as well as web-based and PDF. Um, now we're going to take a look at what uh, our exception management system looks like when we are um, verifying forms that have been completed telephonically. So I'm going to go ahead and dial our, um, our demo phone number for our dental enrollment form. Susan. What is your last name? Thompson. Please say your nine digit social security number or enter the digits using your touch tone phone. January 21st, 1964. What is your street address? 2095 Bent Creek Manor. What city do you live in? Alpharetta. What is your five digit zip code? What is your home phone number, including area code? Say your phone number now or key it into the touchpad. 770 777 07. Okay, now that we've submitted our telephonic application, uh, we can go ahead and take a look at the exceptions that um, may have occurred as a result. Now, one thing that you might have noticed is that instead of the traditional um, push back to the caller of, I'm sorry, would you please repeat that? Um, which is quite common in tele uh, telephone form-based systems. Um, we've simply accepted the information as provided to us and we will then present these exceptions to a data capturer. Um, that way we're not creating a frustrating user experience for the caller. So let's take a look at our voice form. Susan? The first thing to notice is that, like our other form types, um, our exception management interface is identical. Uh, again, the data capture doesn't necessarily know the source of the information. He or she sees it in the same presentation each time. So um, it's got some of our information already from the call. Susan? So in this case, we, we don't have the first name, um, but we have heard the, the sound snippet play from the telephone call, uh, and the data capture can then type in the, the information that the system didn't recognize. Thompson. Same thing for the last name. Uh, the system wasn't sure what to do with it, um, so it, it's, um, the sound snippet uh, allows a data capture to hear what is being said by the caller so that he or she can type it into the interface. 2095 Bent Creek Manor. Alpharetta. And we'll just leave it at that.